Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Good evening. I greet you all according to your time wherever you are watching me. So guys, today's video, we are going to talk about BB Niger season 7 auditions. Let's review these videos together. What do you think? I'm really, I'm a really tall person. The introduction is so, so perfect. It might not be 100% good, but trust me, she nailed this audition video she nailed this her intro video is very good she explained herself where she come from the number of um, siblings she has and what she do what she like what she don't like she, it's so well like she did an excellent job in her video it's it's quite a lot like, but first of all i want you guys to see this e iv informer's own audition video man informer blow it hurts the girl i think the girl will bring fire the girl will bring fire to this house held it yeah if i'm to be one of the big brother organizers or to be big brother itself trust me if Oma is entering the house if Oma is coming in so give me the to give me it. guys let's watch this video together please don't forget to subscribe before clicking out of this video i love you okay expect more of them let's Let's see how I can keep this under three minutes. Of this. Hi, big brother. My name is Ivy Informa. I am 21. I am from Abia State. I live in Lagos. I'm a graduate of the chemistry from Abia State University. I'm currently working as a model, a content creator for social media. That makes sense. I grew up in a family of seven and the third out of five children. Uh, my mom is a really sweet soul, but my dad, okay, my dad is a good father. He's really strict and tight. And the way he um, brought us up made us really tough. So I, I know that I can get through whatever it is in life to me. And I believe that I'll be able to use that to scale through a big brother. So growing up as kids, we grew up in this really queer neighborhood. We are not really allowed to associate with a lot of people except for like church and school. <laughs> And uh, I remember when, maybe when, anytime I want to go out, I would tell my dad, I want to see my friend, and then he'd be like, you have to drop all their contact details, drop their parents' contacts, their grandmother, their grandfather, drop, tell me what time I'm going to come and pick you up, even if they just live next door, like, <laughs> that kind of thing, so, um, but I believe that all that experience really contributed to my life now, in a positive sense, because I grew up to love my personal space to love hanging around my family yeah my family and my best friend Nasa they are my really strong support system um yeah I'm a really I'm a, I'm a free spirited person I love to go out I love to have crazy fun adventures and stuff and just live life yeah I'm very um I don't judge people I try to understand people and I try not to judge people so that way people really like find it easy to confide in me and I believe that I'll be able to relate to what people have seen. So yeah, one thing I find unique about myself is my height. I'm really I'm a really tall person. And growing up I was like taller than all my friends, if or almost all my friends. <laughs> and they used to mock me like, how are you going to marry with this height? If you marry a tall person, you're going to give it to giant. Don't marry a tall person. But I really find my height beautiful. <laughs> yeah, I like journaling. I like creating content for social media. I love good food. I love good music, good vibes, just soft life, basically. I hate whatever, any form of negative energy. I just hate it. People looking, um, putting other people down, people trolling people and things like that. So yeah, I believe with these few things I've said, you should be able to tell the kind of person I am to an extent. 